parents, it's interesting as we're talking a lot up here about in, in general, what does society expect? What do we think your students are capable of? Or is there an expectation that every child should be exposed to Frank Lloyd Wright? I find that parents are no different in many ways than general society and in, in, in two fundamental ways. Every parent wants the absolute best for their child. Not every parent knows exactly what that means and, and what that looks like. Um, and in talking on the conference call a few weeks ago, I found myself agreeing with Peter to some extent. We definitely have some parents who say, you know, a C for the first time, where is this? And where's this coming from? How could this be? And, and there's the, the line of attack on that. But, but more troubling sometimes is the parental response of this is simply too hard. I don't want to put my child through this. They're 10, they're 11. How can you ask them to read? Their friends are at the swimming pool. Um, that is actually, at least in these early stages of Rainier Scholars, the parent piece that we grapple with more. Now, 15, 20 years from now, when we can point to a wall of college graduates and say, this is why you read in the middle of summer. This is where studying Homer's The Odyssey, which you think is crazy that I'm asking your child to do this, will hopefully lead. We don't have those statistics yet to, to give parents that to hold on to, but we do have that fundamental desire that every parent has, which is, I want. I want what is out there for my child. I want their opportunities to, those opportunities to exist for my child. So that's the, we, we work very closely with parents and we're, we're much smaller. We have 60 students per year entering. So we really develop very deeply personalized relationships with each parent, each family. And much of our process is encouraging and getting that buy-in from families that this journey is worth it. The hard work that will hopefully, I mean, it, it's interesting to, to listen to Diane's comments about standards at Trinity, when parents ask, why does this have to be so hard? My response is so that they thrive at the Trinities of Seattle, at, so that they're ready for Lakeside. We don't want your students to just survive on campus there. We want them to thrive. And here is a safe environment in which they can take risks, they can struggle, they can actually fail quite a bit. And there is the emotional and community support that may or may not be there on that next campus in the in those early years of, of moving into those schools. So let's try it on here. Let's push for those standards so that you really are ready. Um, I think that that's how I would. It, the other piece that, that we have found invaluable as we're now heading into year seven, we have six years of parents ready to say this is worth it. 